Now check this out, I know a lot of people are going to have a bias in siding on Beerus for this one, but what if we actually saw Ultra Ego Vegeta go all out against Beerus in a battle of sheer yeah, determination to kind of see where Vegeta falls in this? So what I wanted to ask you guys down in the comment section below are three specific things. Number one, do you guys honestly believe by comparison to Super Saiyan Blue Evolution that Vegeta now would stand a much better chance against Beerus than how he did before? And my other two questions are number one, fan manga idea, Beerus versus UE Vegeta, and if we do end up doing that, do you want to see Vegeta actually beat Beerus, or do you guys want to see Beerus actually beat Vegeta? Because if I have it to where Vegeta ends up beating Beerus, a lot of people are going to be so pissed off only because they're going to say that it doesn't make any sense, but if I have Beerus beat Vegeta, then it's just due to sheer plot armor, right? So for the other two questions, of course, fan manga and sprite animation, I am just destroying this dude. So I was thinking about maybe doing a sprite animation to where Vegeta wins, and in the manga, I would have it to where Beerus wins. And the reason for that is because I want to kind of demonstrate this idea in the manga where Vegeta comes close to kind of rivaling him or doing something of the sorts to where he gets the better of Beerus. But with Beerus being Beerus, he actually ends up beating Vegeta, but it's not really as easy as one would imagine, right? So that's just me. And I don't know, maybe you guys want me to switch that around and give Beerus the victory in the sprite animation, whereas in the fan manga, Vegeta gets the victory. So for the main channel, that's exactly what we're going to do. So let me see if I can actually get the better of Vegeta, because I know that for this ISO, the mods are extremely balanced. And whereas in the others, like they're kind of not. So in the comment section below, let me know who wins. Let's just say if we did have Beerus versus Ultra Ego Vegeta, are you guys standing Vegeta on this one? Or are you guys standing Beerus? Because if it were not for the goalpost being moved, then Beerus would have been surpassed, you know what I mean? Like, that's always been the narrative, you know, placed forward. But just like I guess many people would expect, this right here would be Vegeta's fate. I'm sorry, let me go in ahead and just... Can we get to 120? There we go. 120 hit combo. That's it. Listen, homeboy's done. And what I want to do to kind of finish him off is I want to see if I am able to Hakai him. It only makes sense, like, you know what I mean? I don't think that it gets any more, you know, gruesome than just hakai him because... In the manga adaptations when Beerus fought Vegeta, he embarrassed him, and I don't think that he would embarrass him like that again. Maybe you guys might disagree and say, oh yeah, definitely Beerus would just embarrass him. I don't see that as being the case, but that's right, Vegeta, Sphere of Destruction. Oh, we destroyed the entire planet too. Okay, that's, that's pretty cool. Let me know if you guys also want to see a rematch. I think that's always something that we're open in doing, but there's no way. I want to power up to my max power, and I want to see if I can actually cripple Homeboy by, oh, oh, that's not good. Let me see, Hakai. Oh wait, he got me. Okay, never mind. All right, so now, from what I'm seeing, oh, I'm gonna have to get away from him. Hold on, I have to get away from him because Vegeta, from what it looks like, oh, he's doing it again. That's not good. Hold on, my my life span. Okay, my, my my health bars are dropping. I don't want that to be the case. It's over, Vegeta. It's done. Sphere of destruction. It is over. Beerus wins. A rematch? Yay or nay? Let me know in the comment section below because. Not for nothing, that was that was fun. That was a really good one, not gonna lie.